right here you delete that out and then you can save this file now and then uh, go back to your site make sure you are logging and then come back to the side the, uh, the, 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 fr the front end then click on the add button over here then we Django girls who oh. so it's it's gonna be Django licious then you save click on save then she will redirect you back to the post that you've created the newly created post so you wait patiently so you can see Django girls who oh. then we come back to the site and we can come down 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 then you can see Django girls who oh, everything is there and working perfectly for us so let's assume we we want to create another post and then we click on this and then we say save and it's telling us that we should fill please fill out this first nice one so everything works nicely and uh, we are good to go so let's quickly scroll down and then work on the next the next part which is form validation so we've already validated the form and then the next thing to do we've tested all these things this is required all right so editing the form okay so uh we have to go back to post dot post underscore detail dot html and copy this this and place it inside where the and if is so we come to post underscore detail and where the in between and if then over there we paste it there then you save the file then in block dot url we copy this copy this then come to block 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 Okay, that is my site. Okay, so we have the block.url. So under this one, we hit enter. Then we paste this one to over there. Then uh, we save it. Then we come back to the view. And then under post edit, we input this post edit. So view, view, view come to view view post edit so we create this down below this one so you have the post list post detail post new and now we have the post edit okay don't forget about the indentation is very important this then this okay, I have to do all this okay so another another thing to do let's quickly scroll this up and then undo and I'll bring this one here and uh, I think everything is okay here except this that's supposed to be here all right so we are good to go then quickly save this and what else do you need to do now so um So we will change all right so we are done with everything and then what we are supposed to do is to quickly go to our site and then go to the Django girls blog and see if we can be able to edit so we have this particular at the side of our site 
be able to edit so I click on this so you can see over here we have the edit sign over there and uh, I can just delete this and then save it and it works now so I can let's 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 quickly delete the entire top so that we have why do we use it save so now it works and you can actually edit your post anything at all you want to make any correction necessary corrections that you want to do you can do that I'll quickly put this at the um all right so that is it so we can actually edit the post our heading and everything and it looks so well and well and well all right so um the next thing to do now is security and uh, to do that we quickly go to our base our, where, uh, our base then where the div is on the page uh, uh, header then uh, we add this to it all right so we come here base 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 all right so the base where we have url then this thing over there we are going to put this in it so it will, i'll copy the entire this thing so that i look at what i'm going to do here so where we have this we copy this all of them then we paste this over there then you save it and then go to post detail go to post detail and then do the same thing for post detail so we come to post detail copy all these things here and where you can locate the class where this particular place then we paste this over there and don't forget to save save and then one more thing deploy all right so after you are done with this particular one let's go back to our let's commit or deploy uh, once again on python anywhere so we go to git git status you know the thing git status status then we say git add all dot I say git git status again and then we say git commit commit and we have to type in added views to create or edit blog post inside the site then we hit enter and then we say git push git push all right so all is done now and one last thing to do is to go to uh, the bash at python anywhere and type git pull hit enter wow awesome then the next thing to come uh, we have to do is to come here and click on reload wait for it to reload for it to reload 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 so if you have a very fast internet this should not take all right so it is done now let's click go to the site and then hit enter and see how our site looks online okay nice one so we can also edit our post over here and then i'll just delete this just to show then save And it's saving all right so that works and now uh, all right so that ends this particular tutorial and i hope you enjoy this uh, uh tutorial that i've made all right so uh we have some resources over here when you have the uh tutorial manual you could just possibly click on the links they are all linked together and you can read more about the Python course, HTML, CSS, Django, uh, Carol tutorial, etc. You can learn 
and learn and learn so you, you shouldn't just stop here there's an extension to this whereby you can add pictures and all other stuff to it and um uh, i thank you for taking the time to watch this particular tutorial that i made for you and i hope you like it and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and we will keep on to update the uh, videos for you to watch all right bye bye